If you are into sewing, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. I move on to the cuffs. As I've already said, they are a little too big. My client's bust circumference is not that large, 86 centimeters. I suggest trimming the top of each cup down by about 2 centimeters. Their material allows us to do it without worrying about fraying. As the result, I get slightly shallower cups. Now, let's sew bone casing onto the cups and insert the underwires. I sew the bias tape on with two rows of parallel stitches, leaving its ends beyond the borders of the cup. I will trim them more accurately later. I make a bar tack in the outer corner of the cup that faces the underarms. For the sake of speeding up the process, my bar tacks are just a series of regular closely spaced machine stitches. But I really don't advise you to do the same. Bar tacks made as close zigzag stitches are a lot more robust. I trim the ends of the bias tape. I take one semicircular underwire and determine which end faces the center of the bust and which one, the underarm. I insert the right end of the underwire into the bias tape and push it in. There is some room between the end of the underwire and the edge of the cup, so I make another bar tack there. The underwire won't be in the way. It is for that very reason that the underwire should be a little shorter than the bottom arch of the cup. I remove all unnecessary thread and trim the end of the bias tape. Next, I perform the same procedure on the second cup. The resulting cups are dome-shaped, stiff and fully prepared for getting sewn into the dress. The cups are waiting to be put in place. The under bust line is marked on the dress form for your reference. When I am putting the cups down, I make sure they can perform their function to the maximum without disturbing the harmony of the model. According to the design, the top of the strap will merge with the contour of the neckline. I secure the cups with bits of sticky tape. Next, I insert our spray foam molds. 
They are too big for these cups, so I trim the excess.